Yo, Prof, I heard NASA's been playing with some fancy hybrid rocket motor for them Artemis moon landings. What's the deal with that? Is it going to blow up or something? It ain't. Now, kid, they ain't playing. NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center just ran 30 test fires, 28 in vacuum, two at regular pressure to mimic the moon's brutal conditions. They're studying how rocket exhaust messes with lunar regolith, that dusty, rocky surface. It's all about making landers tough enough to handle the chaos of touchdown and liftoff. Damn, that's wild. So they just blasting rockets in a fake moon setup? How'd that even tell them anything? Exactly. They're simulating the lunar environment to see how dust and debris react under extreme forces. Next, they're shipping this motor to Langley for tests in a 60-foot vacuum sphere with fake regolith. <laughs> it's hardcore science to prevent lander disasters. Man, that's like testing a car by crashing into a sandbox. Reminds me of messing with dirt bikes back in Louisiana, dust everywhere. Ah, close enough. That sandbox data ensures astronauts don't get buried in lunar dust storms during missions. It's engineering meets survival. Holy shit, that's insane. You bet. This is a huge step for safe moon landings with Artemis. Follow if you want to know more. And as always, thanks for watching.